Hello viewers, I'm SB and welcome back to Hades 2 where I'm embarrassed to admit I almost left without putting anything in the cauldron. Uh, let's let's make sure we're, we're making something here. Um, we're going to need a lot of this Moonlit Essence. I can probably afford to just, yeah, just do this. Like, I do want more more beast morsels because I want to feel safe giving one to Freenos and still making sure we'll have enough for other animals we might encounter. But... Yeah, you know what? Let's do that recipe one more time. Power to create. It'll be worth the wait. The Moonlit Essence recipe takes a short enough time that we can do it during a chaos, um, the little chaos side mission things. So that's what's guiding that decision. With your Olympus dwelling relatives assisting you, I have half a mind to ask you to let them know I'm on your side, except not all of them love me. <laughs> it's complicated relationships. What? But you're the great tactician, Odysseus. Even the gods were impressed with your machinations in your glory days. Well, Lady Athena and others favored me, it's true, but your uncle Poseidon, well, I got on his bad side, I believe. Now, maybe he's let it go after all this time, but that's a risk I'm not prepared to take, so keep quiet about me, would you? I hear you. All right, let's head back to the surface and fuck some shit up. I am going to swap keepsakes, obviously. Um, it might be worth taking the evil eye through the second section, you know, assuming that we do get to Eris. But for the moment, for this first bit, do we want to go purse? Do we want to bring something else, maybe? There is some stuff here that I would very much like to level up. We should probably, probably focus on some of that. Um, you know, maybe like the silken sash. Maybe this is a good example. Controlling boons is important. I don't know exactly what these are going to do when they level up. The engraved pin, I'm not so concerned about. Yeah, maybe, um, maybe the silken sash. This will give me some armor, and then once we once we unequip it, we'll still have our whatever armor is left. Should I manage to make it through? Yeah, I think that's reasonable. Oh, um, aspect stuff though. First of all, what is the aspect of Melanoe doing on this weapon? Do backstab damage? Okay, I mean that's not bad. We could certainly go get some Fates fabric, although not a huge amount. We can also unlock the aspect of Artemis. While you channel your Omega attack, you will occasionally parry, then repost right after. So the first attack that would hit you while you're channeling will be blocked, and then you'll have plus 50% crit for a while. That's interesting. It's sort of a weird, like, as you level it up, your Omega attack charges faster. But, like, do you want that? Is that a good thing? Let's unlock it at least. The aspect of Artemis. She knows her blades. And then. Yeah, so we can charge it up faster. Wow, it costs Nightmare to improve it. Well, I guess we don't know anything else that Nightmare is used for right now, so. Lim and Oros, reveal your secrets. And well, one more, yeah. one more nightmare. I mean, I'm gonna hold on to one just in case. Like, I really, I do not know what it is for yet. So, uh, yeah, okay. Are they in this aspect? How do I tell? Do I like interact with the thing here? Such okay, yes. Work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The art on the the Artemis version is actually really cool. Return. Okay. And this just like leaps us toward the nearest enemy, right? Yeah. It, sh it shows us when we're charging. There's like a little red indicator. Okay. And this is, this indicates that I have my, um, I have my parry available. Well, we don't need, ooh, uh, we're ignoring that. We don't need fear, and look, fear does affect 
upstairs because the uh the testament this testament's for Eris. Yeah, we don't need fear for topside yet though. I still need to actually get like okay at it. Um are we bringing the shovel? I think there are metals that we need from topside. There might be plants though too. We really don't have a lot of of these kinds of seeds. Let's let's do a let's do a run with the shovel. This way this time. Strength, knowledge, patience. I bid you shine for me again tonight. You face the Titan in the lowest depths. That much I knew before your headmistress confirmed you vanquished him. As I had faith you would. If his life force is like grains of sand, then you took one. Eventually, all. That seems like a very slow way to accomplish the thing. Behold. All right. Um, I do, you know, moon water's good. Drink deep and persevere. It really doesn't, um, the Omega attack really doesn't deal that much damage, unfortunately. Alright, let's go see what Lady Hera has for us. Lasts 200% longer and deal damage to every foe that joins the encounter. Huh. That's interesting. Whenever you run out of magic, prime to restore all magic up to the reduced limit. So every time, every time in an encounter that we hit zero, it'll lock eight of the bar and refill up to the new minus eight number, and then it'll just do that again. That's interesting. I kind of want to grab engagement ring because it seems wild. Adequate. The city of Aphira, which once stood in solemn tribute to the fear-inducing underworld king and queen, now barely stands at all. Yet it stands in my way. Into Aphira. Back to the main square. And no Heracles this time. Where else can we go? Okay, so what do we want? Uh, let's go get the hammer first. Hey, we haven't seen the helper NPC for this area, have we? Okay, we're definitely doing that too. Hammer first, though. I love hammer. <laughs> ah! Jesus. You. Things are about to turn ugly, and I require neither assistance nor witnesses, sister. Okay, I was here first. You go find your own dudes to fight. I'm passing through, and I'm not leaving here until the traitors to the House of Hades lie broken at our feet. <laughs> Fine, then. We'll each earn our share, though the lion's share is coming with me. Fine. Stay Where's the enemies? <laughs> Pylon destroyed. Oh, that's him. What am I doing? Mine. Fuck off. What do you think about that? There. You earned your share. Okay, we both just get the amount that we earned. You live. 
by my good graces granted, but first I've seen somebody stand against the filth that's overtaken this accursed town. Yeah, dude, same side. Like, I aim to cleanse the filth down to the source. He resides deep in the underworld, though I've business to attend to on Olympus first. This man is literally like more than twice as tall as I am. What a coincidence. I just returned from there not long ago. So the gods are putting all the pieces into place. You watch yourself, sister. I go. Well, that was almost polite. All right, what are we doing today? What's what's blade deal? Your special fires each shot straight ahead and your specials have plus 20% range. The last strike in your attack sequence is bananas and has a chance to crit, right? Like that's exciting. This is pretty cool too. Hmm. We don't really have any boons yet. So our special is usually it's it's like five shots spread out, right? This makes it five shots dead ahead. Let's try sure shot fury or flurry. This seems interesting. Shall we head back, Homer? We can those all vanquished to the last. We can still do a parry and then and then use the special and get the damage off of that, right? Okay. Now I am going to go and see who this is. The barrier's lost some of its strength. Lizard tail. By the dark. Hey. Greetings, witch. Hail, sorceress. Welcome to Ephira. Suffering spreads every which way you cast your gaze, and on a night most foul. Simply appalling, no? Indeed, Lady Medea. Unfortunately, I can only appreciate the suffering for so long, as Olympus calls. Though, how fares your research? Oh, I've been dying to show you. The air here is absolutely poisonous. The conditions? Utterly atrocious. Observe what I have wrought. Who doesn't enjoy a little a little head-to-head -head time with a friendly witch? Uh, Malice in kind is kind of whatever. After each encounter, gain more max magic. I kind of, I kind of like that. That's fun. Yeah, traces of spirit. Nightly curses. Those who shunned or scorn, scorned her only serve to inspire her more. So they say. Night protect us. Thank you. Such violence. Right. Okay. So make it easier to activate our moon water at the very least. Where was I with this? I probably want to talk to Hera again. There's a couple of Heras. We can go really deep on Hera boons. Um, Hephaestus. Hephaestus is interesting as well. I'm trying to think like. What do I want on my special? Hephaestus is going to cause explosions, and that's rad, but it's also really, it has a really long cooldown on the special. Hera's going to give us Hitch, which is like fine. I think maybe let's go, let's go see about Demeter's contribution. She might give me something I'm a little happier with. The champion of Kronos. Whoa. Ah, additional bird. Come on. Ah, oh, you're an idiot. You want to attack me? Okay, here we go. I mean, that, that really chunked his, uh, his shield. What about this? One less pylon. 
Okay, well that solves that problem. Be damned traitor. Huh. Cool. I uh, certainly don't need that, although I did lose my armor, sadly. My understanding was your line could scarce survive beyond the reaches of the underworld. Yet there you are, traipsing about as though not bound by your father's fate. How can this be? Well, you know, fate's a funny thing. Okay, uh, we don't really have boons yet, so rare crop is a little premature. Uh, I would really like to see something affecting my special, please. Okay, plus 60%. Ooh, tranquil gain is a very good gain as well. That's like a really powerful version of it, but I, I want Ice Flourish. Just a big a big damage boost. Freeze is always always welcome. Let's see. So do we do Hera Hera Hermes? I probably you know what I probably want to get Hephaestus on side at least. Let's invite him to the build. Yeah, that's very damaging. Sucker. Even, you know, honestly, even with the um, bonus damage and everything, it just doesn't seem like all that much damage output. Well, it flattened that guy. I don't know. But against, like, the elites and stuff, it's not really tearing them up. And the normal attacks are doing a really good job. Uh, now, we haven't given you a nectar yet. Oh, I didn't give uh, the witch a nectar. I probably couldn't have yet. Yeah, all right. Let's make sure we get all the keepsakes. Lord Hephaestus, your services must be in very high demand. I'm grateful, and doubtless so are the nocturnal arms. That don't work for tips. The arms ain't an ordinary arrangement, and then often they get new regular clients. So here, yeah, call it a trade. I'm in your debt for this, Hephaestus, sir. Welcome to the fine city of Ephira, Witchy. The most important thing to know is, whatever happens to you there, I cannot be held liable. I work weapons, not miracles. Alright, so Smithy Sprint is definitely what I was thinking. Um, yeah, hard to pass up. And just remember that if we have a, a raised crit chance, it can it can do some really mean stuff. Whoa. Oh, I was about to try to... Okay, well... I was about to try to do it, and it was made unnecessary. <laughs> Let's get the lay of the land. I don't think I want to bother with the with the magic. So it is like it's Hera and something. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Chris, you guy and your arms just long enough to hurt me outside of the, the uh, from outside of the zone. Olympus, I accept this message. Uh, this one strikes fine, I guess. Man, maybe I want to re-offer on this. I don't think... I don't think I want family trade. I'm like actually really happy with all my boons. Let me let me see a reoffer. Sure, why not? Now, actually, you know, born gain is kind of interesting with our massively increasing magic. I am gonna take that. I that, grow strong. That is going to be my gain source. I'm a little bummed out there because I was trying to charge up. Um, off of that encounter since I took a bunch of hits, but no such luck. I think I'm just going to go ahead and hit the fountain. <sighs> so Hermes versus another Hera. Let's take Hermes. I release you. Well, that's going to be fun. <laughs> really wish the ground wasn't still on fire. Ow. Once again, getting stymied by the fact that you have to aim at their feet, not at their bodies. A thing which you'd think I would have learned by now. At least the family knows about you now. Always wanted to say, message to Olympus. Persephone and Hades had another kid, and she's all right. But heck knew we had to wait, and she knows a lot. So my lips were sealed. Uh, specials load faster is definitely compelling. Nitro boost is kind of something, but you know what we're going to do here. We're going to re-offer looking for just raw dodge. Yep. Feel pretty okay about taking that. All right. I am not going to... Should be able to get out. Yeah, I'm not going to fire our hex just yet. This is my father. Hi, guys. It's an odd representation of him. I can get out. Doomed city at her back, the princess of the dead heads toward a dismal pasture where she senses she is not exactly being watched. Polyphemus must already know I'm here. Makes sense to me. Uh, let's grab this now, because I would love to see it hit our special. Okay. Lord Charon set up shop. What does it even do on Born Gain? Keep getting shipment to those gold and Kronos coins. I melt them down and dump the goop into the earth from whence it came. So Kronos can make more. Uh, okay, yeah. Vent, right? It's pretty obvious to take vent if you have bla any blast at all. May moonlight guide you. No reason really to take the food. Let's just hold on to the gold and go get the thing done. Polyphemus. Oh, hey. I wanted to say thanks. Gave me a real zinga there last time, you know that? You're back. And you're grateful that I vanquished you earlier? You seem more the sort to hold a grudge. Yeah, but he does get a nice nap out of it, right? I am, I am. It's just... 
I hadn't had a good night's sleep in I don't know how long. After you knocked me out cold, I woke up feeling more refreshed than ever. And real hungry, too. What a surprise. I'm over here. Stink. Right, let's get that heal. Ow. It's like the trick is reactive repost, right? Okay, so that refills it. And then the ground catches fire in an incredibly frustrating way. Well, it is nice to have an option. Okay, the parry just... Right, because the parry doesn't always work. There's a cooldown. Okay. This is stuff I know. Yeah, I really, really, really do not feel like I'm doing very much damage here. Narrowly managed to sneak the damage through there. No, absolutely not. You know, honestly, the um. Vent probably gets him. The freeze is actually helping. I think it is giving me a little bit better control over my timing. Damn it, could you not res enemies directly in the path of my ranged attacks? Alright, the vent's gonna kill him, right? There it goes. Almost died again. <laughs> this weapon is weird. It feels, it's weird to me that it feels weird because like the gauntlets were my favorite weapon in the first game. Well, you know, also the, also the big laser gun. It's pretty good. Um, but it feels like these should kind of be analogous to that. I think part of the problem is that, um, Malinoe overall has a much more sort of like get solid, get solid, stick and move kind of play style. She's just not as dashy and fluid as Zagreus is. Go, Frenos. Where did Frenos... See you in the crossroads? I mean, I said go. He really went. He, I guess he performed it from across the room. Okay. Well, I'm feeling like I'm in pretty bad shape here. And it does make me wonder if Evil Eye is the right call. Maybe I need to just like get on Luckier Tooth immediately. I feel like I'm doing a really bad job and I'm likely to die. 
Honestly, maybe we just, yeah, maybe we just lock your tooth. That one. I would like to get the time to try to, like, learn the fight a little bit more. If anything, it, you know. If we had to, like, focus on one thing, that would be the thing to focus on for me. The docks. All right, the There's Rift of Thessaly it is. I remember this being very difficult and a little bit frustrating. They never learn. The ship's helm. Okay. I certainly don't need the money. Attacks deal more damage and inflict freeze is not terrible. Keeping people in place is awfully useful. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and cold storage. Death. We'll, we'll lean in on the uh, on the freezing special, and I certainly, well, you know, we need a lot of ashes. So for the same reason as when I took ashes last time, it's probably the right call. Take damage from there. Let that be a lesson. And the game's just doing damage to me for the hell of it, it feels like. Okay, that's that's a big area. Stop. Alright. Trying to be a little bit more cautious here. We've already spent a lot of our rerolls, so. Oh, I don't think we saw any of these last time. Let Hephaestus take care of a lot of this. Pure gold. All right, we can play this. Uh, like we can play this pretty safe. I do not need to be putting myself in a lot of danger. Okay. Well done. I guess that makes sense. I mean, is he not dead? I, that's, I guess, the way in which it maybe doesn't make sense a little bit. But I'm not going to look a gift birdman in the mouth. Beak? Are even here. Good shooting. Evening. We made it. 
Uh, yep, Ice Flourish is definitely what I was hoping for. Thought these only grew below. It's really you. Before you say anything, I know I'm not supposed to be here. But I spotted this ship and I had to drop in for a closer look. And now I'm going to take off. So let's pretend this never happened, hey? I really like the design. I'm, I'm, I'm curious to see the final version of that. Hold it right there, Icarus. I'm not about to let you just fly out on me again without a chat, at least. To start with, what are you doing in the middle of this blasted war? The same thing I've been doing. Slowing these bastards down. If everyone like me pitched in a little bit, this war would have been well over by now. That may be so, but this is a matter between gods and titans. I wouldn't want you to get hurt. A bit late for that, Nelly. Anyway, I've kept you for too long, but let me give you something I've been working on before I go. And these will work, I swear. Okay, so he he is dead already. I mean, the, uh, the underworld gates are open, I guess. Each time you clear five encounters, heal and get three random pom three palm slices. That's pretty cool. Four thousand damage to nearby foes is also very cool. You won't be disappointed. I Thanks. like this coating. Can I please? I nope. I was gonna give you a gift. Maybe next time. All right. I'm gonna try really hard to hold on to this destructive coating. New course needs to be set. Um, is this where the camera's supposed to be right now? Right, little 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 bit in error there. Hey! Get out of here. Um actually do I have a nectar? Is that why that didn't work? Yeah, I couldn't give him anything because I didn't have one. Alright. Yeah, it sucks. I think I'm, I'm figuring out uh, how to play this build a little bit. Acceptable. Yeah, I mean we have we have effectively infinite. It's weird that there are seeds on this boat, huh? We have effectively infinite magic with these two things combined, so. I really can just be like all specials and uh, specials and sprint explosions. Yo, Karen, I have great news for you. I have so much money, my dude. A black ship, darkest of them all, disrupts the endless fleet that hounds Olympus. Yet none dare engage with it for long, or with the fearsome captain of its spectral crew. This is so cool. Lord Charon's kept our enemies at bay. Greetings, my dear. I accept this message. Uh, after you take damage, everybody gets everybody gets hitch and damage reflection. I do like this. Now a bond renewed. I wish it was a higher um, rarity, of course. Okay, so. Restores 50 magic is pretty unnecessary. Using fountains gives you plus three hex even if you still have uses left. That's interesting. Makes you impervious. Well, okay, so my, my concern right now is that we may not see a fountain again. Yeah, we need we need abundance to make radiance even valuable because I've already used the hex so much. Uh, and then we get one more usage plus ten health. I mean, if I'm gonna just grab plus ten health, I think on the way to zeal is the way to do that. The path of stars. All right. We shine. So so we have one use of it loaded up here. Salutations. 
What a cool ship. Wheel. That is fun to do. It actually has like really considerable range. Panicked a little bit there. Probably shouldn't have reacted that way. It's hard to aim at the feet of a sword. Okay. I feel a lot better having a little bit of extra HP, and I'm not taking on this trove because I think we have enough money. The next vessel. Call me crazy. Shoot. I didn't even see the guy I got stuck on there. You guys just hang out until the vent goes off. Alright, I mean, I'm doing... I'm doing okay, I think. Do we want more? Hmm. Do I need more Hephaestus? Like, we kind of have the most important Hephaestus boons. We have greater evasion. The thing Hephaestus is going to give us on attack is not actually something I really need. Yeah, let's go this way. Hard to hit the swords with the with the throwing knives. Wow, that almost that almost ate all of my uh, armor in a single hit. That really sucks. In the name of Hades. So we're nowhere near infusion this time, right? Actually, actually, we're we're really close. I'm gonna take tall order. Little spring in my step. All right, please let me buy a wind boon. Well, something nearby. Hera, we're gonna get we're gonna get some kind of boon at least. I'm gonna hit this before we hit anything else. Um yeah, better damage on the sprint, I think, is a is a pretty valuable one. I need this. If you have at least three earth, all your common boons gain rarity. We don't really have a lot of common boons. Uh, re-offer me? Do you have air boons? I don't think you do. Okay, well. We can pick up Sworn Strike just so that we can, like, spam attack against her back. I guess, like, Freeze, Nasty Comeback will go up a rarity. Yeah, that's something. 
All right. A boon awakened. Oh, it did hit greater evasion. That's a fair point. But sadly, it does not allow me to turn on Tall Order, which we will just simply never have for a meaningful boss fight. <laughs> what a frustrating thing. All right, at least we get to have Eris be the one who breaks our shield. Now take me to the coast. And we still have most of our death defiances. Trouble. Come on, really? I thought I made myself real clear with you before, but here you are like nothing happened and it's just another night. This is just another night to me, Eris. So you stand with Kronos against the gods, so what? You're just another obstacle on my path. Hate to break it to you, Trouble. Obstacles are things you're supposed to avoid. But in this channel, you're going to run into me every time. Ooh, you'll regret this. All right, we're doing some doing some work here. Ow. Yeah, maybe you can stop sitting inside of burning oil. I guess I may as well hit this. Didn't like that. Okay, double damage again. Oh, she destroyed some of the cover. Okay, well that's not very fun. I mean, we're getting her. Her pattern's really not that difficult. I <laughs> love you, Hephaestus. I uh, wasn't quite close enough. Oh, right, no cover. Gotta remember. Come here, trouble. That's gonna do some significant damage to her. How could you be so cruel? Okay. You started it. Didn't even have to spend a death defiance. And up we go. Thus, having overcome the fate wrought curse confining her to the underworld, the Princess of the Dead ventured out onto the surface realm. Her aim to reach the mountain of the gods and there disrupt the massing forces of their crafty foe. Except. Much more's to be told of that in due course. But let us say for now. She ran into some difficulties here and there. Okay, fair enough. Return to Shadow now. Congratulations, you have thwarted troublesome Eris, the embodiment of strife. And your surface goal is finally in sight, Olympus, besieged by the forces of the Titan of Time. Uh, however, there is, of course, a lot. Listen, we got a lot, a lot of work to do yet. It's a big video game. Returned. Yeah, she's not nearly as bad as Kronos. She's probably not actually the final boss of the surface area, though. That's a, like a, probably a point worth making. You know what, buddy? Let's see if giving you another treat does anything meaningful. Got something for you. Okay. Freenos deals bonus damage leaping onto foes. I, I never notice his leaping damage, so I have no idea how often that actually happens. But, like, Soul Bond and Life Bond are both, I think, really interesting. 
honestly, I might prefer Soul Bomb. Just like chunks of Psyche are going to be valuable for a long, long time. Yeah. Huh. Love you, Freenos. Well, I gotta be honest with you, I was not expecting to get a clear there, and we met, like, we met all kinds of new Difficult. fun characters, and I didn't get to give them nectar at all, and... Eris outright attacked me, just as I was approaching Mount Olympus. Who gave her the adamant rail, anyway? A weapon once used to slay titans turned against the gods. The rail has turned against the gods before. Only the fates know its true and final purpose. But Eris has it by their own decree. Perhaps as a plaything to keep her occupied. To keep me occupied, apparently. Makes me wonder if the fates want Chrono stopped or not. Did you and Eris ever fight like this? Oh, yes. Much as I tried to avoid it. Oh, she's not even here. Well, whatever. I'm still picking up after her. Terrible stuff. I'm not allowed back here, right? Not now. Okay. That is stuff for later. Perhaps like the Ambrosia, which I cannot figure out how to use. Hail, a learned sage. Okay. Well, let us claim our, uh, our stuff here. Which of the crossroads? Fresh from the pot. It gladdens me to see you, Hecate. I have observed the stalemate upon Olympus holds, although the Titan Kronos musters forces in a fear still. Shall I continue monitoring them? Yes, Selene, do. Blasted if fear is the closest exit out of here. Do you suppose they are prepared for a single assailant to weave through their ranks? The Titan's forces are somewhat in disarray. Thus, no, I do not think they are sufficiently prepared for one of us. But I shall watch and make certain of it. For now, I must be off. Together, we shine. Farewell. Together, we shine. More or less, you know. I have an idea. Have your animal familiars stay in the training ground. When rested, they can harvest plus two times. Oh, that's cool. We do not... Well, I might have more weed seeds now. Also, that is the first thing we've seen that use, uh, uses tears, I believe. I encountered mighty Heracles on the surface. No mistaking him. Though I thought he was dead. He seemed very much alive. On the outside, anyway. And still in service to the gods. The great Heracles. That's a complicated one. Part man, part god... Pot monster too, perhaps. You already said, man. Rules of death don't quite apply to him. What did he want? Did he give you any trouble? He was quite brusque. Told me to stay out of his way. Sounds like he has a task of his own. Maybe Olympus isn't counting on me to succeed. Eh, don't take it personally. You have wise relatives and ruthless ones. They may not like their odds hinging on any one individual. And do watch yourself with Heracles, I... I up you go. All right, a whole bunch of poppy, and I already don't remember why we wanted it, but I know we did. Uh, let's get mandrake, definitely useful. Live and thrive. Uh, garlic, we don't need so much. Let's plant the mystery seed. This is just nightshade. I don't think we've seen anything in particular that calls for garlic or like for, for any of this stuff in a while. I guess we'll plant some My nightshade. Flourishes. You end up using a fair amount of nightshade. Grow strong. Okay. Oh, what have we there? <laughs> Nemesis is out. This won't be ready yet. Oh. Ah, cause yeah, cause we have something we can hit. Well then, let's do that. As the three fates would have it, so shall I. See that, sisters? Record keeper, pleased to have you here. That's adorable. 
Okay, so warding circles found throughout Erebus. Don't know anything about that. Waiting for the Mandrake. We need another uh, driftwood before we can reveal a hidden isle in the Rift of Thessaly where one might use a fountain and perhaps refresh their hex charges. Locations on the surface sometimes contain a shrine of Hermes. Well, that'll consume all of my driftwood. Special order useful items using money. I mean, it does feel like we have a lot of money when we're up top. Yeah, actually I think I'm I think I'm cool with that. Can we get can we get some fate fabric? Friend. Already built up a pretty Thank decent you. supply of fate fabric. Uh built up a pretty decent supply of bones again. Should be everything. Upon my birthright, I command the dark to aid my task and with me find my mark. Your intent was true. Okay. Uh, so we should have plenty of these now. We definitely want to keep gaining moonlit essence. Power to create. This will take a little while. We're going to need some more stardust, obviously. Anything in particular change over here now that I beat up Eris? We bid you welcome to the vanguard of the underworld. I wonder what it'll be like next time we talk to her inside the crossroads. You remained upon the surface for considerably longer than before. How was it? Any good? War rages above. The Olympians sent Heracles himself to contain the damage. Shades of the dead linger everywhere. So, not good, all in all. Yeah, kind of a bummer, really. Shades of the dead? Sure sounds like more disciples we can use. Uh, sprint into him, will ya? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, I know the thing. I just always forget. Moonlight guide us. It better. Okay, yeah, nothing, nothing special here. I guess we did, we did have this. This is a, a thing that costs tears. So the aspect of Eos for these things requires two clears of Eris. That's interesting. Your attacks grow bigger and stronger and return whenever you sprint. I mean, I can certainly see how that's powerful. How that could be powerful. Uh, I still never actually built the rod of fishing, but like obviously bones are not my primary concern at this point. Although, ash is important and bones, bones is ash. Do I wanna go get, do I wanna spend, spend bones on 20 ash to unlock this and then like refigure Obviously, I'm not eager to turn off um, Eternity or the Champions. So the most obvious sources of three additional Psyche not available to us. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I guess we can wait. I guess there's, there's no reason not to wait. So unfortunately, it's going to take us two different card picks to, uh, or two different card unlocks to reveal both of these. And then this plus either one of those. We're close to being able to see everything, at least. All right. So I feel like we've sort of completed the content uh, a little bit here. We've, we've sort of seen all of the scene and won all of the boss fights uh, that, that we have to see and win. I'm still having a really good time, so I think there's going to be a couple more episodes. But uh, but yeah, maybe we're maybe we're drawn to a close here. Um, so that's going to be it for us for today. Thank you all so much for watching. When you come back next time, I have no idea exactly what it is we will be doing, but we will be doing something. There is yet more, more Kronos murdering to come in our future, and we'll see you then.